For the conversion to work, you can't save any timesheets in the current pay period of your quick pay payrolls. You can check the status pane at the bottom of your quick pay payroll. If this is reading time and pay calculated, then you've already completed processing in the current pay period and you must set the next pay period before you can do the conversion. Once you've ensured that this payroll is at status start of period, please log into any other quick pay payrolls that you have that you wish to migrate and make sure that they are also at start of period. If you intend to merge a number of quick pay payrolls, you must make sure that the payrolls are all on the same computer or network location. You can check where the payroll data is located by clicking help, then system information. Log into each of the quick pay payrolls and make sure that this path is the same. Next, you need to make sure that all the quick pay payrolls share the same tax year and pay frequency. They must also have the same tax registration number and be on the same pay period. 